Life in big cities is constant hustle and bustle. People are always on the run. Surprisingly, quite often they tend to respond to this bustle by running in the literal sense of the word. In recent decades, running has become extremely popular in big cities. According to statistics, people mostly choose running when they want to introduce some sport into their lives. The rapid development of running in Kazakhstan seems to confirm this statement. Amateur runners started to establish running clubs in Almaty, and then the trend spread to the capital and other large cities. Evolutionarily, running has always been vital to humankind, its culture and development. I might even add that brushing teeth is less natural to humankind than running, even for a pregnant woman. It's a very natural activity, because even before the development of civilization, people always had to run. They escaped from enemies, run away from wild animals or bad weather conditions. Whether you were pregnant, slim or overweight, whether you had one leg or two, you ran. That's why running is so popular. It's absolutely the most natural sport activity after walking. People in Kazakhstan mostly choose running to maintain a healthy lifestyle. Running involves a healthy diet and breaking of bad habits. More and more people realize the significance of their health, and running is the easiest and, most importantly, an accessible way to maintain their health. It does not require a lot of money, special equipment or conditions. Although the financial matter is not so simple after all. At the beginning, it seems super easy. Just put on your sneakers and run. However, in fact, you need some devices like a watch, a heart rate monitor, sunglasses. You also need to frequently replace the sneakers, not to mention the winter gear. For a beginner, running is the cheapest sport. You don't need anything but simple sneakers to start with. Then there are t-shirts, shorts and after that comes the sportswear of higher quality. Then there is sports nutrition and fees to participate in running competitions. Today, for example, we had to buy a slot here, so the expenses keep increasing. But it's like fishing, you can use a simple fishing rod made of wood or a super expensive fishing rod and a fancy boat. Fishing can be a quite expensive activity too. Abundance of different running competitions effectively proves the popularity of running in Kazakhstan. Every weekend there are at least a couple of races in Astana alone, and several dozens of large national events are held each year. Only about 2,000 runners used to attend such events just a few years ago. Today the number can reach up to 20,000. They are people of different gender, age and occupation, but all very passionate about their hobby and achievements. Yeliusis Pardabai is already over 60 and he has spent at least 40 years of his life doing sports. Every day he tries to run at least a couple of kilometers, swim and ride a bicycle. This cheerful senior citizen is a well-known and long-time participant in almost all races held in the capital. I run, ride a bicycle, sometimes two or three of us ride together. We take part in bike marathons. In fact, I participate in them every year. It's exactly 25 kilometers through the forest zone from Koshre village to Urker area. There are usually 50, 60 participants. I was the first among the older generation to join. It was covered in newspapers and on TV. Thanks to sport, I feel young, happy, full of energy and life. I sleep well, I don't get sick, don't go to doctors and don't take medicine. And most importantly, each day of my life is interesting. It also helps me set an example for young people. And of course, I get to be a bit famous. The popularity of running keeps growing. Today, there are already 2 million members in various running clubs across the country.